The Federal Ministry of Health has called on stakeholders to raise the profile of adolescents in commemoration of the National and International Adolescent Health Week. This year has the theme of building a case for the visibility of adolescents in Nigeria while transitioning from a pre-pandemic to a life shaped by pandemic. Dr. Hanire made this remark during a press conference in Abuja. He said he was making all efforts to strengthen effective coordination of adolescent health program nationwide. Therefore, he urged all partners to replicate the same structure in their respective states. This is to ensure continuous delivery of essential gender response service and to mitigate barriers faced by adolescents and young people in accessing service. This is a week-long participatory event for stakeholders working in the adolescent health space with the theme Transitions, Building a Case for the Visibility of Adolescents in Nigeria while transitioning from a pre-pandemic to a life shaped by the pandemic. To raise the profile of adolescent health, and to discuss strategies to improve the well-being of young people in Nigeria. The federal government will continue to collaborate with partners and stakeholders at all levels to support in interventions that respond to the needs of young people with various kinds of vulner vulnerabilities. Every attempt must be made to ensure the adolescents who are the soul of our population are adequately cared for. To grow and develop in good health, adolescents need information, including age-appropriate, comprehensive sexuality education, opportunities to develop life skills, health services that are acceptable, equitable, affordable, appropriate, and effective in safe and supportive environment. We need to ensure that adolescents are visible, that they have the agency, the choice, and the voice. They need to be visible in our policies, in our plans, in our budgets, in our services, in all sectors. And I, I think it's great that we have the adolescent health week, but it goes beyond health, right? It's adolescent in nutrition, adolescent in education, etc. and including engaging the private sector. We believe that we, we need to look for to empower adolescents so they have the agency, the voice and the choice to give them the spaces in the public uh, arena and the public uh, space. Adolescents need to be prepared physically, mentally and, and psychologically. There should be a cohesive effect from effort from parents, guidance, teachers and the government to ensure that we transition successfully to the next important phase, adulthood, which comes with great responsibilities, decision making and character building for a greater nation. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.